I have 18 inch bare brakes, but they made the wheels go down a little bit further. And how uh, okay. far out they are now, it looked even worse. So I and it was the so okay, when I get back, running calipers basically. Yeah. Yeah. When I get, well, hey, the way you really put the light. rotors on, it sets about another yeah. inch. So I'm like, okay, when I get home, I'm going to shut my rear end, and when I do that, then it's going to put the big brakes on. Oh, okay. okay. Well, like I said, even. Yeah. Even works. Even works. <laughs> even more freaky. Yeah. Yeah, everyone's like, just leave them out wide. I'm like, no, I built the car to be tough tire. That's why I wanted at least an inch or so of a tire inside the car. Sure. It looks fantastic. Oh, thank dude. you. You knocked it out of the park with this car, man. It's awesome. Appreciate it, guys. It's, it's freaky. It's freaky as hell. And I love I love the relocation. So is this the original hood line? Yep. And that's, 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 that's the exactly actual. That's a factory spot. I added two feet to it. Basically, this section of metal came out right here. So I basically everything that's up front is original gremlin material other than the two feet that I added in the middle of the fender. How economical. Yeah. Like every part of the gremlin Nothing is still goes here. To waste. Nothing goes to waste on the scene. Yeah. It's a green gremlin. It's a cool. No. It's, I don't a, know, but... it's, a, it's a green, yellow gremlin.